Okay, back for round two. This is Select Soccer 16-17. Very eager to bounce back from the disappointment of the Tops uh, Museum Champions League box early on. Absolutely the worst box I've ever broken uh, as far as that, could, uh, that product is concerned. Well, it's bound to come sooner or later, isn't it? You get a fair share of good hits, you get a fair share of busts and duds. That's what box breaking is all about. Alright, uh, for Select Soccer 16-17, um, prices have really gone down considerably. Which is why I'm really fencing another crack at it. All right, let's go. Let's hope for a good one. I really need to bounce back here. This will be my final soccer product for the day. My third box later on will be a WWE box, which I've not opened for quite a while already. As far as wrestling is concerned, it's been a while since the last broken copy box. But let's get this uh, over and done with first. So come on, let's hope for a good one. And right away, this is a uh, national pride. Nice, Luka Modric, most likely going to be crowned uh, the Ballon d'Or winner. Won almost every prestigious individual award in the year 2018, despite not winning the World Cup. So he's really scooping, scooping up all the uh, glamorous uh, individual awards, which perhaps to him is just a consolation prize, really. Nothing fantastic here. I'm gonna go real quick for this video because I get the sense that you know my video space is running out. This is a memorabilia card, Lucas Fabianski. Nothing fantastic here. Plain white jersey with no number at the back. So the national pride so far, the pick of the bunch. Blue Eden Checo. Blues, I believe, are the highest number. Yes, number two, two ninety nine. So one memorabilia, one memorabilia hit down, and this is the second memorabilia hit. So we got a white jersey and a black jersey, both non-numbered. So. When it comes to the memorabilia hits, pretty poor. Come on, something has got to give. Let's hope for a good one as far as the autograph is concerned. This die cut is Edir, match winner for Portugal in Euro 2016. And this should be the autograph hit. Looks like it's a non-Jersey autograph hit. Ooh, okay. I may have gotten him before, but uh, and I've gotten him before in uh, Real Madrid colors in black gold. But you know what? Due to the impending status of being, you know, kept as the world's best footballer, and I think he already has because he's won the uh, FIFA Best Awards uh, for Best Player. He's won Champions League Best Performing Player as well. So it's rather inevitable that he will pick up the uh, last big individual prize, which is Ballon d'Or. And this is numbered, nice low number as well. So I consider this as a good bounce back. Although it would have been better if, you know, it was a new addition to the autograph collection. Well, I guess I have my new, a fair share of new additions already. Those two dirt hits are from Topps Museum. Yeah, those two are new additions. But they're from teams like what? Enderlec, FC Basel, come on. This is a lot better in terms of resale value and collectible value. Luka Modric, so I think I've completed the Modric set, got a Real Madrid autograph hit uh, of Black Gold Soccer. Now I've gotten his uh, Croatia autograph card of Select Soccer. This is a nice one. Personally, as a Liverpool fan, I will be hoping for Mo Salah to pick up the Ballon d'Or, but well, it's hard to go against uh, the current tide, isn't it? Having picked up so many awards already, Luka Modric, there's no way he's going to lose this one. Alright, let's wrap up. Three more packs to go. Uh, what else is there to hope for? I think um, maybe a nice color card to end things. Maybe a gold or a green would be nice. But no, I don't get gold, I don't get green, I get another blue. This is Kevin De Bruyne. Another blue, the 2 99 
Come on, one final flourish. Give me a good color here. Ooh. Three memorabilia hits. You know, sometimes Select Soccer does have inconsistent packing. And there are also some boxes that have three memorabilia hits but no autograph hits at all. So luckily I've gotten one of these uh, not so accurately packed box which turns out to be a better one because there's one more hit to offer and something shimmering here. Oh, it's not gold, it's bronze or copper. Yeah, they call it copper. And fits the color rather nicely as well. The jersey color and the uh, border color is a nice match. So a copper number hit of Wesley Snyder to end this break. So it turns out it's a pretty all right box. I got more than what I bargained for just to show you that there are indeed uh, three memorabilia hits to come from this box which is pretty unusual but as far as this product is concerned I'm not surprised because there has been some packing inconsistencies just lucky enough to be at the uh, right receiving end of it and the prized number card for this box is a Wesley Snyder Copper and of course to top it off the crown jewel of this box is a Luka Modric nice everything on sticker just a little pity that there's some a bit of a wobble right here I think my uh, black gold autograph looks a little bit better than this one because it doesn't really have that wobble all right but nonetheless it's still a Luka Modric autograph very good to have for the uh, soon to be named I honestly think it will be him soon to be named Ballon d'Or winner all right so I'll see you later on for tops WWE uh, 2018 heritage I'll see you then goodbye